Lily. Sue Lily. Sue Lily. FCS is Fulfillment Center Systems, and we build and support the software that runs in our fulfillment centers. Anything that involves moving product from one point to another within the warehouse, we write the tools that all of the associates that work there use to get various functions done. We have three domestic fulfillment centers in Reno, Nevada, Columbus, Ohio, and Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. And we just opened a fulfillment center in Shenzhen, China. We work in a DevOps model, which means that whatever you build, you're also supporting afterwards. And that's why developers really have that ability to decide what technology they want to use because they're the ones that are going to have to own it. Zulily believes that building our own software gives us a strategic advantage in the marketplace. And so we're very much a build shop. We don't spend a lot of time integrating applications together. We build applications. Developers pretty much have control over what tech stack they want to use as long as their teammates can agree to also support and build in that. We build in microservices using Java, MySQL, and Rabbit messaging queues. We typically deploy using Docker images. On the front end, we'll use Angular materials and Node um, working in uh, Happy JS and Ionic frameworks. And our front end UIs typically are web UIs, um, even if it's for the mobile app. You want to use Docker and Node and Kubernetes to write your latest application? You have the freedom to do that, but we do have a 24-7 mission critical warehouse operation to support. These things, they, they have to hold up. You can write like the UI for, for packing or whatever, but then you have to remember that it takes the associates some time to like put this product in this box and tape it up and do all that kind of stuff. So you have to like be cognizant of that when you're designing. We own our code. We, we own it. We own the application in production. We have to support it and we have to collaborate with other teams that may in turn be responsible for supporting our code. So last year we've done over 4,000 deployments in a year. Uh, we definitely operate under Zulily time and really follow continuous uh, development. Many things that as software developers we know we should be doing, we should be designing for horizontal scalability, redundancy, performance analysis, metrics capture, good logging, unit testing, documentation, and in our environment, these things become must-dos, absolute must-dos. Once you're in that mindset, you're constantly thinking, how are people in the real world going to interact with this? And if I make their job harder, how are they going to try and circumvent it? Along the way, our internal customer is FC Operations. And I am fortunate to have this customer because they get it. They get that engineering work uh, isn't perfect the first time and that going back and investing in, in a system is worthwhile. I've worked a lot of places and I haven't worked a lot of places where, you know, after three years I can say, wow, I am, I am so far ahead of where I was when I started that um, it's startling to me. We are encouraged and supported in doing what we do best, which is writing software and getting it out into the world and improving it. From like from like a growth perspective, because you always are getting input from other people so you can learn, oh, this is bad because of this reason, and this is a really good idea from someone else on the team. The effect that that has is that it organically brings developers to the next level. It's It creates a fantastic team and a fantastic opportunity for developers to, to grow in these areas. Zulily. 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 Yeah, it's a, it's a fantastic place to work. <laughs>